Syllabus Statement 224, recalling the sources and describing the functions of carbohydrates, proteins and lipids. This is 224A. There are a number of different types of grass which having flowered form seeds and these seeds provide some of the world's most best known sources of carbohydrate which are from rice and wheat so these are the seeds of these grasses and these are both forms of starch and of course starch is a form of carbohydrate. Let's not forget another well-known source of carbohydrate which are the root tubers of the potato which is also starch, stored starch in these tubers here and that of course is a form of carbohydrate. Carbohydrates provide us with energy through the process of respiration. Our second food group is protein. Animal protein is a well-known source and let's not forget the fish also animals but an important source of protein in many parts of the world and once more plants can provide us with protein in the form of beans and seeds and protein is associated with growth and particularly of muscles. Our third group would be the lipids. So from animals like this we would get fats, from fish we would get oils, and from plants we would get things like the various oils such as palm oil uh, or possibly sunflower oil and fats and oils are known as lipids and these are associated with stored energy good way of storing energy and also of insulation.